What is it, YouTube? This is Nebluxer9, and welcome to a little game called Deep Sleep. This is a game I've actually been waiting to do for a while, and I've been listening to this theme for almost five minutes, and it's kind of annoying now. Hi, and, guys. And I've never actually done it yet because, well, I just haven't gotten to it, and I just didn't feel like doing it. And I know I'm very late to playing this video game cancel, but you know what? Let's just press new game and get in it. Alright. I'm just woken up. I think there's something here. Yep, there's a key here. Let me go over here. And I think I used the key to unlock that. He yelp. And my friends, we are now in the deep sleep, as it's called. And there's a school latin. Uh, we're gonna grab his arm because I forgot why actually. So anyways, logic means that we're going to want to go to the phone that's over here. We're actually down here, even though it's showing us, like, like yeah. We're going to go up here. Never mind, we're not going to go up there. We're going to go down here. It's showing us up here, but we're going to go down here. And there goes the dog. Alright, so he's just gonna tell us to wake up. So we have a light, flashlight, which is gonna come in handy later. And there's something in here, but we need a key for it. So we go up here, and then we go down these stairs. Down this ominous, very deep, very deep stairwell. Very deep. Very deep. And then there's a, oh, I didn't mean to go down to the furniture room yet. And there's a bell there, obviously. I'll let you read this. Sorry. Okay. I'm gonna do something quick, be right back. Okay, so now with that done, we wouldn't normally go in here, but we don't have a light. Or we have a light, but it has no batteries. So that's something we need. So we're gonna go in here. Oh, wait, no, we can't do anything in here yet. So we're gonna go down these stairs into the boiler room. So, oh yeah, that's right. this is what we need the bone for. So we take the bone and put it in there. We turn it off. And we can open this. I said we can open this. Oh, it's too hot. So we grab this rag. And then we wanna go into this room here. Soak the rag and the thing. We want to go down, back down here, and over there. Grab that. Okay, grab that. I said, grab this. Did, did you not hear me? There you go. Grab that and go in here. So then there's a key right there, and then we can leave. Now we have the key to go to another room. The other room was, I believe. Oh yeah, it's that, um, the phone, dude. Yeah, this is a really weird stairwell. So we go back to phone guy room, and we grab the key, open that, take the batteries. I said take the batteries. And we combine them with the flashlight. And we can leave. Go down here. And then we can go into here. Alright. Wake up. It's inside. Spoopy. So this is what we're gonna need. We're gonna need this golden statue later. For some reason, I don't remember why. Right, this is just another room. All right. So we go here. There's a window, and now we can go here. No, I said we can go down here. So, there's a passcode we have to put in. We have to go find said passcode to open this door. It is locked up tight, and we cannot do anything about it until we find a passcode. Which, I do not remember where the passcode was, actually.
Alright, so now we can leave this room. And then I believe it's not here. And here. Hmm. Alright, so I found where we have to be. I remembered it for the code and it's back in we're back in the boiler room inside the furnace again. So I'm pretty sure this code is random every playthrough, so don't look at this and assume that's the code. So it's 0508. 0508. 0508. 0508. Alright, so 0508. Nailed it. Now you open the door. Head inside. So that's a pickaxe there. So now you have this black figure chasing us. Now you basically have to escape. So that diamond we picked up in the beginning will pay will play a bit of a role in what's about to happen. <clears throat> so now we go over here, and we use the pickaxe to break this open. I said we use the pickaxe to break this open. I said we use the pickaxe to break this open. So now it's open. We go outside. So there's a lighthouse over there. Very ominous indeed. So we go inside the lighthouse. And here we have upstairs. somewhere I remember now hmm. key 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 I need a key okay I am now back I went to consult the guy because I forgot where the hook was it turns out I completely forgot how obscure the hook it was and you have to go here, and the hook should be over here somewhere. Oh my god, the guide lied to me. Are you serious? I forgot this was a thing. Okay, so I have now found the hook. Um, turns out you have to go right down the stairs, and it's right there. It's just so obscure, and you have to use the hook on the net and then go up there. I said you have to use the hook on the net and go up there. And now we found out why that guy was saying wake up forever. It's a recording that was meant to talk forever. So now we have the golden key that will unlock this box. And a diamond is inside this box. And this box, or sure I say diamond I mean, is not really a diamond at all. I'll show you guys why in a second. So we go to the lighthouse. Notice how those creatures are made of shadows. So now they're gonna chase me up the stairs. We can use this to kill it. It's kind of hard because, you know, it has like a delay on it. If you let go of it, it keeps going.
So anyways guys, that was Deep Sleep. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more content and more videos. And I'm going to try not to slack off. The reason I haven't been doing any gameplay videos or anything like that in a while is because one simple reason. I just simply, you know, had nothing to do for any videos until, of course, I just thought about doing Deep Sleep. So, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.